I thought because it's like a brand new start this year, I thought I'd give you a tour of our house. So I'm gonna show you all around our gardens, house, outside kitchen. I'm gonna give you a full tour of our house because last, maybe you didn't see the videos from last year. Maybe you're brand new to this channel and you wanna have a look around. Now we're gonna show you. Come on then, let's go. So we can start here. I mean, here is just like a little storage area. This was a nice little present from the guy who we bought the house. He's kind of ethnological, builds all nice traditional things. You know, everything, the house comes with all this, <laughs> with all this old style things for farming. It's really into his ethnological, old style, traditional ways. Um, I don't think I want to use some of this. I mean, look at this for the grapes, yeah? <laughs> I, who knows? It might get to that point we're going to uh, use these sort of things. So here we just got like a little mazata, a little storage thing here. Yeah, which at the moment we've got loads of rubbish in here. We've got our bottles and things like that, you know. Here we're going to be storing our compots and all these sorts of things. I've got some bricks here. Eventually, I'd like to make a fire pit. That's what these bricks are for. Hopefully we're going to do a fire pit. Look at this full bidon, full bottle of petrol. Petrol prices getting crazy. Yeah, getting crazy these petrol prices. So we should have actually got a couple more of this. We could have done with a couple more of these actually. Let's go and have a look at the outside kitchen now. So this is like the summer kitchen that we've got. This over here is just a septic tank. I wish it was a well. We'd love to be able to have our own water. It'd be really nice. Look, Nuznik, Nuznik. This is an outside toilet. <laughs> Yeah, we don't know what we're going to do with this yet. I think we're going to change this. We're going to change it from a toilet. Yeah, at the moment it's a toilet. It's not very practical, but we're considering chickens here. Chickens in here. They can run around outside just there. Wonderful. Then better than some fresh eggs. Bio eggs. Excellent. Here we have our outside kitchen. You can see that's going to be ready for getting put up soon. The greenhouse. Nice big table. Who knows, we could have some big feasts here with friends, friends and family. Invite everybody round. We can have some really nice times over there, I think. This is like actually like kind of a wheel thing for, from a tractor. It's been converted and we can clean all the rust off this. But they use this for cooking. Amazing. You put fire underneath and you can cook on this. It's absolutely amazing. Here, we can have this like a little barbecue, a little fire thing. I'd like to make this a little bit bigger and able to close the top, you know, and I'll, I'll make it like a pizza oven style. -y. This is what my plan is with this eventually. Last year, this was all stones. Now we got a professional in, put some tiles down. Absolutely amazing job. Looks wonderful now. I'm very impressed with this. I was very unsure about this when we first bought the place and how we were going to do it, but these guys have done a great job. So also, they made all the floor for us here, nice. We bought a nice little sofa here. This is actually supposed to be t together, but it, it just didn't fit anywhere. And Petya had the wonderful idea to split it up. And now looks great, I love it. Got a nice big table there. It's a bit of a mess, I mean, we're not here. Here's my uh, trimmer for the grass. Before we had a big fire over there as well, but it just wasn't practical. I mean, the hole inside was so big, it was just never going to heat anything up. So we got them to fill it in and then we bought our Bechka. Nice, beautiful black one. I need to put the handles, the sides on the outside here, the handles. But this is going to really do a great job to warm up the place. And it's kind of a traditional, like this is a, this was one of the nice, unique features of the house that I really liked. A sink made from stone. Now, I would like to make it a little bit nicer. I'm not a big fan of this big chip chop chip chop sort of style there but I think if we fill it all in put some nice grout in the middle there white it's gonna look really nice would be nicer to have something inside there I don't know exactly what maybe you've got some ideas you could tell me what we could put inside there some quality Bulgarian wine I love this wine this is amazing wine great great vineyard this one here we've got a little outside area, kind of not outside area, but this was all open actually, and they built all this for us nice, filled it all in. So now we're gonna kind of be like, we've got our washing machine there, we've got another oven here. So it's kind of like an outside kitchen. Sadly, all Petia's flowers have died, I think. 
not being here to water them, which is a bit of a shame. I mean, this is a little small area. Look, I mean, look at the size. Yeah, <laughs> good job I'm a small guy. Petty is small, Jeanne is also gonna be small, so, but you have to be very careful here. How many times that I've banged my head on this thing? Oh, even being small. I'll take you upstairs and we can have a look up there. Yeah, so you have got to go outside to get upstairs, but that's not a big problem, I don't think. Eventually, maybe we might be able to make this so it comes inside. It's just a small little two bedroom. We just got internet put in. Yeah, Petty is not happy with this, with the wires going up all over here, but he told me I have to figure a way out for that. Maybe we have to put it outside somehow. Uh, maybe just a little box up there or something. We can put it all out there. I don't know. Ah, anyway, they put the nice floor down for us. This is one of the bedrooms, master bedroom. I mean, they're both the, the same size. They're not huge rooms, but what do you need? Simple life, simple living, simple life is the way forward. I think of that the, the way that the world is at the moment is not great, is it? I mean, capitalism, communism, whichever you want to say, democracy, all these things. I mean, they don't seem to be working, do they? Everything's a big lie. Everything's all um, how the big people want it. So I think the only way to live the life is to come back to the simple life, maybe. So here we've got Jana's room. They call this one the Jana and Grandma's room. So if grandmas, one of the grandmas, one of you grandmas, if you're coming over to stay, this will be your room with Jana. Got some nice views out to the garden there. Obviously it's a little bit sad at the moment. It's the winter look, you know, it's not with the snow or anything, but the trees. A nice little look out to the forest that we've got just over the other side. All this kind of, we kept some of the stuff. I mean, we might polish it up, make it look a little bit nicer, but this old traditional stuff. And you know, I've learned a lot since, be, uh, since we took this house. I mean, I put, I fitted all these lights, which I've never done all that stuff before. I'm not, I'm not, this is not me. This is not what I grew up to do. Handyman jobs, jits, jits. But if you live in Bulgaria, you have to learn or you have to pay through the nose. So Betty doesn't like to pay through the nose. So I have to learn, but it's great. It's great, I'm learning now. Look at this nice little, I, I love this uh, calendar. What do you think about this calendar? Let me know in the comments what you think about this calendar. I love it. I think it's really nice, yeah. She gave in one thing she allowed me. I said, we need a shower, but a rain shower. One from the top, just like in the hotels. Love it. Works great, nice. They fixed all this. We've got another one of them kind of interesting sinks nice big boiler there as well that's gonna be excellent i took a shower with that looks really great really great yeah lovely terrace here imagine just sitting here nice summer day we're gonna make all this nice and soft you know we're gonna get some spongy stuff to put down on there and then just looking over the beautiful garden this will be amazing down there we're gonna grow some Grapes, you've got grape vines, up, but they, they, last year the grapes didn't come up too well. They didn't come up too well. So, I mean, we've got some stuff to do there. And we have to decide whether we want to keep all these apricot trees, whether we're going to remove some of them. I mean, you can see the small ones over there. I put a cherry down, a couple of cherries down over there and over there. Apples, peaches, we can, we can change them for different trees. That's what we might end up doing. Uh, that's a nice big pear tree that we've got there. It's an old one. I mean, the pears are great though. They're really tasty. Kind of winter pears. I mean, they come and they fall off towards the end. They led them to ripen up, but it's really tasty. Nice little fig tree down there. Have you seen that one? Need to clean that up. Got a lot of work on this year. I've got roots to take out. I've got, I've got the whole garden to clean up of all the old grass. I let the grass really grow high. Didn't have any time to come here last year that much. The grass grew so high, I wasn't able to cut it. Got a bit of time in the winter time, cut it. Now it's all there, I need to rake it all up. I need to cut this fig tree. I mean, I've got a lot of stuff to do. Putting up this uh, greenhouse that we've got there. Um, and, and really, I wanna grow, 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 grow. Grow as much as I can. Bio products, then I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna cook with you. I'm gonna show you my recipes. We're gonna grow fruits for rakia we're going to make rakia together and i'm going to make compots we're going to do everything i'm i'm really all up for it this year can't wait super excited yeah so if you want to join us don't forget subscribe hit that bell for notifications i'm going to be hitting videos 
two, three times a week, hopefully, maybe even more. But let's get it on. I'm super excited. Hope you are too and come and join us. See you later.